Hello and welcome to Solid IRA. My name is Mike Rosica. I've created this video series for you in mind. I am a 63-year-old person who started a self-directed IRA, uh, I guess about 14 years ago. I have managed to build that up to quite a portfolio of assets to throw off capital. Uh, I'm so fortunate that I was able to discover this uh, asset class completely, completely by accident. Unfortunately, in this country, only maybe three to five percent of the population use a self directed IRA. Now, I was actually told that it's three to five percent of people that have IRAs in general, which is a very small percentage. So you've got to figure out of the population how many people have an IRA and of that population, how many of them are actually self-directed. Very scary, very sad. This is one of the highest potential uh, investment vehicles that the government allows and no one takes advantage of it because no one knows about it. Well, I'm here to change that. I'm here to move the needle just a little bit. If I can go from 3% to 4%, if I could help a million people retire, uh, I can lay down on my grave and feel like that was a pretty big uh, um, accomplishment in my life. Uh, I've managed to figure out quite a few things with the help of uh, some really smart people that are in my life, uh, some tax attorneys uh, and CPAs that have managed to get the word out to a select few people. And now I would like to exponentially help uh, more people retire. So, so let's take a let's take a let's take a simple case study to show. How many people are affected in a positive way by me making one real estate transaction? So let's take a look at this. Uh, I find a house that is worth $100,000, and it truly is worth $100,000 on paper through uh, an appraisal. And that house generates $1,500 a month in rental income. Okay, so how can I help anybody with this? Uh, I don't have $100,000 in my self-directed IRA. Let's say I have $20,000 in my IRA. I want to buy this house. Well, there's a number of things that I can do. I can use my $20,000 and I can borrow the other $80,000 in what's called a non-recourse loan into my IRA. And then purchase this house, pay back, let's say the person that I borrowed that $80,000 from is my brother-in-law. My brother-in-law has an, a, a regular IRA. I show him the benefits of rolling that into a self-directed IRA. So he takes 80000 of his normal IRA that he's usually buying Apple stock with and mutual funds. He rolls over 80000 into a self-directed, uh, let's say, a, a Roth or a traditional IRA. He lends my IRA the $80,000. I pay him a 10% return on a monthly payment back to his IRA. I take the $100,000 and buy the house. I have a property manager collect the fifty. To $1,500 a month. I subtract out the debt service to my brother-in-law, might be, uh, I don't know, $700 a month. And so now he's getting an 8% return that he never got 8% before. I'm getting a healthy return because I borrowed the majority of the money. I'm using someone else's leverage to buy that house and I'm getting a steady stream of five or six hundred dollars a month stacking up in my IRA. And so 
I've helped three people out. I've helped my brother-in-law get a serious return, 8% compared to what he was getting uh, before. He was kind of shell-shocked and not doing anything with his IRA money. So now he's getting 8% where there was zero before. It was actually the cost of living was actually eating away at his money because he wasn't getting anything. And so he was paying annual fees on that IRA money for doing nothing. It helped out the homeowner who was selling her house because they bought that house for 50,000. Now that he's got a hundred thousand dollar profit, all cash, great transaction, smooth closing. And it helps me with my IRA and it helps my family uh, in the future because now I'm stacking money that I typically didn't have a lot of. I am only out $20,000. And so I'm getting $500 a month. How long will it take for me to get my 20 grand back at $500 a month? So it helps everyone. Uh, it helps the tenants that move into the house. It helps property manager. He's making money that he wasn't making before. Uh, it helps my custodian because my custodian is uh, a part of the transaction. And we're putting money into use. We're putting, we're cycling through money and where money was not available before. Do this times 10, do this times 20, do this times 30. Uh, my brother-in-law and all of my other relatives and friends and family that I'm using their money to make these transactional purchases and giving them a flat 8% return, uh, annualized at 8%. And they're unlocking their CDs, their certificates of, what did what one person make? Certificates of depression and getting that money into their IRAs and then being able to lend it out. I only had 20 grand in my IRA. Pretty soon I'll have 50 grand or 60 grand as these rental payments stack up. I may be able to go out and buy 50% of the next house. I may not want to buy 50% of the next house. I may like just keeping the 20% of using 20% down payment and using someone else's IRA uh, to fund all of my deals so that I can grow exponentially. Uh, the idea is, hey, if you're 28 years old, 30 years old, you've got a lot more time to grow your IRA than if you're 55 or 60. And uh, so at 60 years old, you need to be a little more aggressive. That's what we're here for, to train you, to show you that, hey, these deals are available. These deals are out there. And it takes a little bit of effort, a little bit more than sitting down and watching a football game on Sunday and knowing the stats of every player and what they weigh and how long they've been uh, playing ball and all that stuff. And just take that energy, some of that energy and put it into your retirement account. In the beginning, it may not feel that great or that sexy to be talking about these types of deals. But when you start seeing the numbers add up, adding up quickly and knowing that you're helping your family uh, at the same time, you may just realize that, hey, you know what? I'm going to put more energy into this. The more energy you put into it, what do you think? The greater the outcome, the results that you can get. So this is video number four. Uh, we've got many videos to come in this journey and uh, look forward to getting your retirement account up and running, getting those funds available getting deals into your funds and watching the money stack up. So again, my name is Mike Rosica, Solid IRA. Uh, please give me a thumbs up on this video if you like it. And uh, we'll see you on the next video. Uh, try to share this material out with other people, people that you think can benefit uh, from having their own retirement account. Everyone should. Uh, most don't. Uh, I've gone over those statistics uh, I don't want to keep beating a dead horse, but it's horrible what's going on out there with the lack of education in self-directing. So again, thanks for watching. 
uh, see you in the next video.